Does it seem like people don't respect you? Perhaps they don't listen to you. Maybe they brush your emotions aside or never pick your ideas. You might feel that you just don't matter to others. In this video, you'll learn how to get people to respect you even if you don't have a high social status. 1. Be true to your word and demonstrate your reliability. If you cannot keep your promises, you should not make them. Try to make amends if you can't keep your promises. Apologize without making excuses. 2. Be consistent. It is normal to alter one's views, preferences, and way of life from time to time. However, if your words and deeds contradict one another, others may conclude that you are arrogant or a liar, which will not earn you any respect. You will come across as indecisive or dishonest, for instance, if you say that you don't drink alcohol but typically have a beer when you're out with other people. 3. Don't engage in gossiping. This is a bad habit that will not earn you respect. If you give someone personal information without their permission, they probably won't trust you again. In addition, if others catch you talking about someone else, it's possible that they'll conclude that you'd be happy to talk about them as well. 4. Talk so that individuals pay attention to you. Many persons who battle with getting regard feel like they have no voice and that no one pays attention to them. You'll gain more presence if you listen to yourself. Your close friends, family, and co-workers may respect you because of your presence. 5. Use confident body language. Our body language can tell people how we feel about ourselves. For instance, assuming you stroll around with your shoulders slouched, arms crossed, and your eyes on the ground, you will appear to be bashful, apprehensive, or uncertain. None of that commands respect. However, if you have confident body language, people might look up to you. They may believe that there must be a good reason for your confidence and, therefore, you must be worthy of their respect. When you start asserting yourself more, people will become more aware of your presence and give you more space in conversations. 6. Keep your temper under control. If you lose your temper, nobody will take you seriously because they will believe you are too emotional and irrational. 7. Improve your listening skills. If you can pay attention to what others are saying and respond in a meaningful way, you will probably gain their respect. Good listeners often come across as empathetic and caring, which are admirable qualities. A good listener can make others feel appreciated and valued, which may earn them respect in return. Start by paying more attention to other people in conversations if you want to improve your listening skills. Make eye contact, put your phone and other devices away, and concentrate on what the other person is saying rather than what you want to say in response. Allow them ample time to speak. Not every silence needs to be spoken in. 8. Avoid oversharing. It's common to talk too much and start rambling when you get nervous or want to make a good impression. But you can't ramble and talk about yourself to get respect from other people. To begin, you need to slow down and come up with some common ground. As a result, people will begin to value your opinions and contributions. 9. When you need it, ask for help. Asking for help does not mean you are weak. People who are honest about their limitations don't pretend to be able to do everything. Others may admire your self-awareness if you are willing to admit that you require assistance. Don't let your pride hold you back. At times, most of us require assistance. If you are a manager, for instance, it is acceptable to delegate some of your responsibilities or ask a coworker for assistance if you are feeling overwhelmed at work. 10. Accept responsibility for your actions. Those who maintain their composure even after realizing they have made a mistake are acting with pride. Prideful individuals quickly lose their peers' respect. Be careful not to equate pride with pride in one's identity. Self-respect is when you are happy with who you are. Pride is the belief that you are superior to other people. It is always humbling to admit wrongdoing. Making errors isn't fun for anyone. In any case, actually we as a whole commit errors, and every single one of us will be off base sooner or later. 11. Remember the golden rule. Be kind to others as you would want to be treated. When others are acting badly, give them the benefit of the doubt. You might not be aware of something they are going through. Keep treating them with respect regardless. When you refuse to treat someone badly, even when you could have, it says a lot about you. 12. Give credit to others. If you take credit for the work or ideas of someone else, it is unlikely that they will respect you. Give people the credit they deserve. You want people to have faith that you will give them credit for helping them. Say, thanks. 
For instance, if your friends compliment your garden design because your sister helped you redesign it. Although it was hard work, I was fortunate to have assistance from my sister. 13. Stand up for other people. You might gain respect if you stand up for someone who is being bullied or treated badly. When everyone else is supporting the victim, it can take a lot of self-assurance to defend them. You don't need to begin a major contention while you're safeguarding somebody. A straightforward, hey, that's not fair, stop being unkind, or, that's a mean thing to say, can we move on, could be examples. Might work. You can also advocate on their behalf when they are absent. You could, for instance, say, hey, I don't think we should talk about people when they aren't here to speak for themselves, when someone starts gossiping in a group. 14. Give a hand when you can. According to research, you might gain status in a group. For instance, a recent report showed that in social environments, individuals who help other people will generally acquire higher status than the people who aren't really charitable. 15. Acknowledge your good points. You shouldn't brag. But you also shouldn't be afraid to acknowledge your good qualities and achievements. This doesn't mean you need to tell people these things directly. Bragging won't earn you respect. According to 2015 research published in the journal Psychological Science, people who brag tend to come off as unlikable. But don't be afraid to let your talents and accomplishments show. For example, if someone asks you how things are going at work, it's fine to say that you've been working hard and earned a promotion. 16. Stop apologizing for yourself. In extreme cases, both dominant and submissive behavior can be detrimental. Respect will come your way once you strike a balance. Imagine that someone spills their drink on you by accident. Then, even though it was the other person's fault, you say, I'm sorry, out of habit. You will need to save your apologies for the occasions when you are truly sorry if you want to gain respect. 17. Stand up for your opinions and beliefs. When we compromise our beliefs to fit in, we disrespect ourselves. When someone questions your beliefs, you can be assertive while still being respectful and polite. Try to be comfortable both with your own beliefs and with the fact that some people will disagree with you. 18. Avoid too much self-deprecating humor. People often respect people who have a good sense of humor. This could be because, according to a study, we typically associate intelligence with humor. However, not every kind of humor will earn you respect. Self-deprecating humor, in particular, can hurt you. 19. Present yourself well. You don't have to be naturally beautiful, athletic, or handsome to gain respect. But making the most of your appearance and presenting yourself well may encourage other people to respect you. 20. Keep up with what's going on in the world. If you can talk about the latest trends, news, and pop culture, you'll come across as knowledgeable and tolerant. Respect can be gained through these characteristics. In general, good conversationalists are those who demonstrate a wide range of interests. Keep awake to date by skimming the news features each day and taking a gander at the points that are moving via online entertainment. 21. Make friends with people who are respectful. If your friends are disrespectful or irresponsible, other people might think that you are like them or that you like how they act. To gain appreciation, select your companions cautiously. Instead of spending time with people you feel ashamed to know, spend time with people you truly admire. 22. Enhance your leadership abilities. Leadership abilities have the potential to earn respect, particularly at work. Being a pioneer implies being an individual who assists the gathering with accomplishing its objectives. Even when it goes against what others want or believe, strong leaders stand up for what they believe is right. 23. Create a distinctive skill. Experts frequently command respect. Find a special skill if you don't already have one. You could try learning a sport, a craft, a musical instrument, or a professional skill like coding or public speaking. 24. Work on your weaknesses. You can earn respect by identifying the skills you need to develop and putting in a lot of effort to learn them. 25. Don't just point out problems, come up with solutions. Attempt to recommend ways of advancing the circumstance. You'll be known as someone who can solve problems rather than just complaining all the time. Now tell me, what are you going to do to earn people's respect?